Hey everybody, welcome back. Uh, I've got another new snack to try today. This one is not really new. It's been out for uh, about a year. Uh, they are a little difficult to find. You, you won't find them in, in too many stores. Uh, Safeway's been carrying them. I've seen them at a couple of other stores, but uh, you don't encounter them too, uh, too uh, often. Uh, but this was something I was really excited about uh, when I first heard about it. Uh, probably about a year and a half, maybe two years ago. Uh, and then uh, last summer they came out and I tried them and I actually really loved them and these are Fruity Pebbles crisps. So these are basically uh, Fruity Pebbles um, that are, are, are presented in, in a way that's uh, more similar to potato chips. So as you can see these are, and, you know, when we open the bag you'll see what they look like, but uh, these are actually round uh, crisps like a potato chip. Uh, flavored and colored to look like Fruity Pebbles. And there's Fred Flintstone there. He's been their mascot for a long time. A lot of you, if you're uh, particularly young, you may not be too familiar with Fred Flintstone, but I grew up with the guy. He's a cool dude if he loves Fruity Pebbles. Uh, I'm gonna love Fruity Pebbles too. Uh, but anyway, we're gonna open these up and try them out for you and let you know how they are. Um, they're not, again, not too common to find, but you can find them if you do look for them. You may have seen them in, in some grocery stores down the cereal aisle. It's where they're usually kept, aside, uh, rather than being uh, marketed with the, uh, the potato chips and, uh, and the other uh, uh, snack chips. Uh, but yeah, these are really good. Let's get them open. So here we go. I am a huge fan of uh, breakfast cereals in general. If you've seen some of my other videos, you've heard me mention that before. I'm also a huge fan of Fruity Pebbles, especially. Uh, it's one of my favorite cereals. These smell uh, really good. They smell like Fruity Pebbles. <clears throat> and uh, again, you know, I have tried these before, so this is not really a reaction video. It's more of a review, but uh, that's what they look like. They look like um, uh, look like a bunch of Fruity Pebbles smashed together. <laughs> Maybe uh, if you left your Fruity Pebbles in the bottom of the bowl and didn't, didn't eat them all, and they dried out, you would end up with something like this. Uh, these are actually not Fruity Pebbles though. They're actually kind of similar to a rice cake. Um, Fruity Pebbles, uh, if I'm not mistaken, are a puffed rice cereal uh, with fruit flavors uh, added, but these are not the same type of puffed rice that you would find in the cereal. They're not as crispy, they're a little lighter and airier. Uh, uh, they're much more similar to um, uh, the uh, rice cakes, uh, like a, uh, a lot of people um, would describe those as, as tasting like styrofoam. I, I'll put up a picture, I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about, but these are similar to that, except they're infused with the flavor of Fruity Pebbles, which are really fantastic. So yeah, definitely they taste a lot like Fruity Pebbles. The flavor is not really throughout. I have a feeling these are actually dusted with a Fruity Pebble flavored um, uh, powder on the surface. Uh, so as you're chewing them, that kind of goes away. It's not really, it doesn't stay in your mouth while you're chewing. Uh, and eventually you end up with something that tastes kind of like a rice cake, which is, you know, not the best, but you still have the flavor of Fruity Pebbles in your mouth and uh, it kind of makes up for it. And these are actually really good. Not only really good, but a whole lot of fun. Um, you know, how often have you seen a snack that looks like that? This is really unique and, uh, you know, it's really cool. I have a feeling that uh, a lot of kids would like this. Uh, these do come in also in a uh, Cocoa Pebbles uh, variety, <clears throat> so uh, same concept but chocolate, uh, those are all brown. Uh, I like Cocoa Pebbles also, but Fruity Pebbles are by far my favorite, so I've kind of stuck with these. And they're a really good snack. Nice and crunchy to have a, you know, nice and crisp um, mouthfeel to them. And, uh, you know, you just can't beat that. There's nothing like these on the market, nothing else like them. There are other cereal-based snacks, but none that taste and look and have the, the quite the same texture as these. And these are, these are really fantastic. I really recommend them. I've been through several bags since they came out. Uh, and, yeah, I hope they stay on the market. Like I said, they've been around for about a year now. And I have seen them in various places. Um... Uh, but, you know, uh, if you're looking for them, you will find them. Uh, and they're really good. I highly recommend them. Uh, as a matter of fact, these would be really great uh, if you put them, uh, you know, on ice cream. Which, uh, honestly, uh, now that I mention it, uh, is another thing that you can get. Fruity Pebbles actually has an ice cream flavor. There are actually several cereals uh, that come in ice cream. And maybe I should do a review of those at some point and, and let you know how those are. Uh, but, yeah, these are really good. 
Again, you probably put them on top of a Sunday. Eat them like chips. They would go really great with some kind of creamy dip. I, I don't know what kind of dips are out there. Maybe like a whipped cream. Um, but yeah, really good. Highly recommended. Fruity Pebbles Crisps. Uh, there's Fred, as he would say, yabba dabba do. Uh, they are super delicious and I highly recommend them. Thanks for watching the video and we will see you next time. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. <clears throat> Hit the bell symbol for notifications and we'll see you later. Bye.